Hello YouTube, my name is Abam and now I will continue about creating login form. Here, I add another statement here. I copy and paste and paste again. And here, I need like this and uh, equal nothing. Okay, and here. I add pass and equal nothing you can add nothing or you can add like this okay here maybe you must type Username, maybe like this, and copy, paste, password. Okay, maybe like this. And if I have a empty value, you must type a username and password. Ah, okay, sorry. I must add uh, exit sub okay and copy this add here okay try again and if I add this you must type username okay and I add a username login you must type a password and I add a password if I add a username and password if there's no data from table there is no rows at position 0 okay like this and maybe I change uh, information maybe it your username and password maybe like this okay and I think I don't need this Okay, I don't need. Hmm. Okay, I don't need this. Okay, if I start debugging, if I add Agus one two three login. Okay, now I have N. And if I go here, hmm, okay. I check if mm. okay, TB dot rows zero dot item one equal tb username and tb dot rows item to equal sorry db pass dot tag okay maybe like this and here dot tag and I 
this change to here okay maybe like this okay no data found with your username and password and if I add a right username Okay, I change like this. Okay, maybe I check. Ah, sorry, sorry. I need trim here. Trim. And okay, here trim and here trim. Okay, sorry, I need trim function. Okay, I have so my form one. Okay, you can add a uh, anything you want to validate your form application and if someone not type anything or uh, error maybe you can handle with a function like this try and catch and if someone add uh, Right, username and password he can so form one like this okay i hope my video can help you to understand about database in visual basic 2010 and if you like my tutorial please subscribe my youtube channel and thanks for watching goodbye